What's up guys, Noor here and welcome to the finale of this series. In this video, we'll be going over the catcher, designated hitter, starting pitcher, and manager. Before we begin though, let's take a recap and take a look at the team we have built now. At first base, we have Kirio Kazuma. At second base, we have Meg Thomas. At shortstop, we have Lucio. At third base, we have Max Payne. In left field, we have Chuck Green. In center field, we have Leon Kennedy. And in right field, we have Twitch. I'm really excited to show off the rest of the team, so without further ado, here they are. At catcher. Kratos! In my opinion, catching is the hardest position in baseball. It's as taxing physically as it is mentally. You have to be squatting for around 90 minutes a game. You have to frame, block, and chase pitches, protect the plate, pop up and throw out runner stealing, in addition to fielding weak choppers, bunts, pop-ups, and all the base running and swinging you're going to do on offense. As far as the mental game is concerned, you have to call the pitches, change signs, and control the running game. Well, who do we know that's tougher and more strategic than the former God of War himself? Kratos dies around three or four times in the series and just keeps coming back for more. He's led his own army, faced all manners of mythological beasts, braved all types of terrains and elements, and slain pretty much every Greek titan and god. There seems to be no challenge too great for the fallen demigod, and like Twitch, he too has killer arm strength. See? That's a yeet, in my opinion. The designated hitter. Coach! The senior member of the Left 4 Dead 2 survivors might not have the speed or athleticism necessary to play the field, but Coach has proven that he still has plenty of pop left. Coach has shown he can swing from both sides of the plate, and he was a star of the pre-order ad for the baseball bat itself in Left 4 Dead, so it's almost like he was fated to be on this team. In Coach, we have another clubhouse leader. He's very likable and has proven to essentially be the moral fabric of the Left 4 Dead 2 cast. But as uplifting as Coach can be, he has shown that he isn't afraid to get dirty and kick some ass. Your starting pitcher. Waluigi! If I had to rank the most popular game characters and not get a game, Waluigi would probably be at the top of that list. While he oddly isn't playable in Smash, although Piranha Plant is, don't ask me why, he appears in pretty much every Mario sports game and he always seems to be the best among his peers, whether it's tennis, soccer, or golf. He has the goods. I like to refer to him as the Bo Jackson of Mario games. He's downright great. He's easily the best pitcher in Mario Superstar Baseball, which made it a no-brainer to have Waluigi toe the rubber for this team. The Manager Ocelot! Who better to manage this group of oddities and heroes from all times and places than the King of Finesse himself? Ocelot has played almost every government and faction he has been in contact with all to reach his ultimate goals. In Phantom Pain, he runs Mother Base and the Diamond Dogs in Snake's absence, so he's no stranger to managing an international group like we have on this team. Now I know Ocelot has claimed in the past that he'd never trust a Frenchman, so hopefully he can put that aside to work with Twitch in right field. Ocelot has masterfully set forth plans to dispatch the Patriots once and for all because of his loyalty and admiration of Big Boss, and I assume he'll establish that type of clubhouse presence minus the espionage and treachery. Ocelot also fits the build of a baseball manager. He's old, gets angry, seen a lot of shit, but he's kind of cool under all of it. It'll be really interesting to see what kind of plays and alignments Ocelot will run with all the talent he has been given. Well, that does it for this series, guys. I had a ton of fun working on this video. So this was a nice project. I really enjoyed doing this. So let me know what you think about my team and please tell me who you'd have on yours. If this series accumulates enough views, I'll get to work on a bench and relief video. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you guys next time.